when you've got five kids, so getting somewhere like the Lock Park, it costs you an arm and a leg. I did try selling one of the kids, but there wasn't having it. I'm joking, <laughs> I'm absolutely joking. And you know, and then when they find out where you're gonna be, they all scramble and get there. And it didn't stop me day at all. You know, it's part and parcel of what I, what we do. And um, then these pictures emerge on on the internet, and I knew straight away. I saw, as soon as I saw the picture of what it was it printed, it was myself. So this and, is a picture of you and Molly. Yeah, on a, a roller coaster. And it was the most unflattering picture of my daughter. My daughter is absolutely beautiful, yeah, she but is. they really, really highlight this picture. And I could see straight away what was going to happen. It was going to evolve around a weight. And, and that's when it did happen. We just ignored it, left it be. Next thing it's in the Mag gossip yeah. magazines and other newspapers. In fact, it went in all the newspapers. And look how beautiful she is. Yeah. Mm. She's absolutely stunning. And that, that obviously isn't the picture. The picture that was online yeah. was you coming down a water slide with your hair, you're all yeah. laughing, your head's yeah. thrown back. Yeah. So probably for most of us, not the most flattering uh, of pictures I anyway. I mean, I, I look like God knows mm. what on it. And I, sh I showed it Molly straight away. I said, look, you know, cos I'm really open and honest with my children. And the first thing Molly said, oh, God, look at all my chins, she said. And I was like, baby, you're beautiful. Well, Molly's a really strong, independent woman. She's got a lot of character. She's very strong-willed. And she's very much like myself. You know, we always poke fun of ourselves. But what the sad thing is, it then escalated on to social media. And they were questioning your parenting skills yeah, as well. Now, absolutely. we all know how much we love yeah, your kids. That, she's a young girl, and, like, say for Harvey, you know, we both stick up for our kids. He's not aware of it, so I'm the only one who can stick up for him. But in your case, she can are, see yeah. what they're saying, yeah. and she's a young girl. You know, you get enough abuse on it, and it's not fair for her yeah, to... Absolutely. I know you're a great parent, so... So did you warn her? <laughs> um, you know... You, you said then, as soon as I saw that picture, I thought she's going to get some yeah. some trolling yeah. here. Did you say to her, look, don't go on your social media, or no. did you just say, no, absolutely be prepared not. For this? No, no, I just showed her the picture, showed her the, the write up that it was, and focused on all the good things that were said. And it was a really, really good write up, and I was really proud, you know, sassy teenager. But I knew by the write up and the picture that used at what they were getting at, and yeah. I knew it was going to so escalate. So, how did she deal more. with it when she went on her own so she, She's on her own social yeah. media. And all these comments are coming yeah. in, not very pleasant. How did she deal with it? She was like, she, look what they're saying. And, and Molly was just like, she, and Molly's very quick witted. I don't know where she gets it from. <laughs> and she, you know, she likes to stand the ground and, and gob off herself backwards, back to whoever's given us some abuse. And, and what I said to Molly is, Molly, block him, ignore them, and yeah. don't retaliate. Did Brian what... ever say anything? Or did she ever talk to Brian? Has he stuck up for her? I don't think Molly has that. Don't get me wrong, Brian sees his daughters yeah. and, you know, he picked them up last night. I think it was last night, but yeah. he must see it. Does he not say anything? I don't think that's what they talk about when yeah. they're together. You know, I'm, I'm basically... She's really close yeah. with me and yeah. I'm a mum, but I don't, even if Brian but was... But did she cry? Was she upset? Did no, she cry? not at yeah. all. Molly wasn't upset. And I, Molly's really quick-witted. I said, Molly, don't even retaliate back to them, darling. Oh, but, not worth but it. can I just say one thing? I'm not being judgmental here, but your kids have been in the spotlight yeah, a since lot with born. you. But isn't that a bit of tough for any kid? Oh, absolutely. I think it's but tough for... Kerry, well, you know, what What do you, think, do you think it's had on them? Because they might not tell you. She might oh. not tell you what she's thinking. The thing is, with Molly and Lily, I mean, I, I was... They were born into this industry. They don't really know any different. And I am very open and honest with my children. And if anything, I know for well, I'll be the first person they come to. But what I have done with Molly and Lily, they have separate counsellors and therapy. So if they is something that they can't talk to me about, then I always make sure they have... Cos they have nobody else to turn to. Because they didn't I choose... No, absolutely. They didn't choose the life that you've put them into. I completely they? agree with yeah. you. But whether Molly was in the limelight or not, what I'm here to discuss is the awareness of what people who troll other yeah. people yeah. and oh, put yeah, people yeah. down. Unfortunately, it made headlines. Well, no, in fact, fortunately, it did make headlines with my daughter, which I am grateful about, cos it just goes to show what low-life people are out there. Yeah. 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 You said, um, you said that you know Molly is a very strong girl. She's a very independent young yeah. woman, and she has got something to say about this herself. Have Go, a look Molly. At this. Go, Molly. <laughs> hey, everybody at Lisa Men. I just want to let you all know that trolling can be really hurtful and can damage some people's self-esteem. But personally, it doesn't affect me because I'm a really strong person, and I was brought up by really strong parents. And okay, siblings. 
But, um, yeah, so I think it's kind of pathetic and it's kind of childish. what Janet said. I did said. make her say that, by the no. way. <laughs> but, but bearing in mind what Janet said, because, you know, your life is oh, very absolutely. much in magazines yeah. and things, has this changed how you might go forward with your children, where your children are concerned? <coughs> Do you then avoid going to very public places with them for that reason, that not they could be all. photographed? Absolutely not. If I started avoiding everywhere in case I was going to get backlash on my children, going to get some negative report, I might as well stay housebound. Mm. This way, the way I look at it with my children, it makes them self-aware yeah. of what is going on in the world. It makes them stronger. Uh, and not for, people say, tell them to get off Twitter, tell them to get off this social media. It's like, but well, would you not do that? Well, no, because if it's going to happen on social media, it happens in skills, it happens if they go to an event, it, or all our kids it on happens social media. wherever they're going to go. And all they're doing is run away from the problem. And I know Do my you... children, sorry, I know my children, yeah. and I think this makes them a stronger person, a stronger character, and lets them give it a nice sight on, on how not to treat people. I've always said to my children, you've got nothing nice to say, don't say it at all. Do you think Molly... Is like your mum in she's some very ways. Mature, Molly she? is very mature. Her, she's Lily, still listening to what she says. She's very old for a while. She's very old, and uh, Lily's even older headed. My 13 year old's a lot more. Love you, Molly, but Lily is a lot more old headed than Molly is. And what it is with my all my children, they're very protective over me. Yeah. And there are times when I've had to say to Molly, "This is not your house. This is my house." And my say one of the kids have been naughty. Molly's straight in there shouting at them like Molly. You're the sister, not the mother. For more Loose Women action, click here. And I'd subscribe if I were you. It's totally free and it means you'll be kept up to date with new videos and exclusive YouTube content.